And now, 6 1 from Chicago, Illinois, your host for the Give and Go Hoop Show, Low Battle. What's up now? Uh, I want to talk about some craziness today. Well, it really ain't crazy, <laughs> considering the fact of this. When I was a little boy, I wanted a basketball jersey. And it's way back in the day now. And I went to the sports store and I gave old boy $2 for a number. And he asked me if I wanted to sew it on, that'd be another $3. Well, I only had $2, so needless to say, uh, we didn't get it sewed on. And it looked a little sticky on the back, so I decided I'll take it back to the crib, put it on the uh, ironing board, take my little jersey and iron the number on so I can go out and, you know, and floss in front of all the other little fellas. Well, I went on and did that. I took it home, I ironed the little number on, and I went out, and I started playing ball. I think I maybe played for about five minutes before the number came off the back of the jersey. And I was like, embarrassed, need to say, because, you know, all my boys out in the alley, they started to clown me, you know, and tell me, you know, that that's a cheap jersey and, you know, and all that. So I was like, okay, needless to say, I went home, took the jersey off. But that was $2. <laughs> I watched a couple of NBA games so far this year, and uh, Adidas has come out with these new jerseys, Revolution 30, where they say, hey, we're going to make it lighter, faster, you know, fast don't lie, as they say. And uh, so, it, so the players can play up uh, to their potential a lot better. Well, I've watched two games, and and two games where the players have been playing, and the numbers are coming off the jerseys. And I just had to flash back to when I was like nine years old, and I ironed that number on my jersey, and I was like, oh my God, I can't believe this is the NBA. This is the billion dollar, multi-billion dollar company Adidas who've made jerseys for the players and they actually covered off the back of the jerseys. And just last night, I happened to be watching the Knicks and Amari started my heart playing and the next thing I know, all I see is New York on this jersey and the number one is gone and the guy at the scores table got it. So I started thinking, wow, $250, that's what they cost. I'd be a little bit pissed off if I went and paid $250, not the $2 I spent, the $250 for an authentic NBA jersey where the numbers come off just like it did when I put the $2 number on. All I can say is um, Adidas, get that woman out the back where you got sitting up there ironing all these numbers on and up your game and get it ready. And I can't believe Nike ain't took advantage of this opportunity already uh, with them putting these weak jerseys out. So uh, y'all need to go on ahead and get it together, <laughs> Adidas, because uh, this ain't gonna hold up. This is weak. And I can't believe you asked somebody to give you $250 for that. So uh, anyway, <laughs> may all your jump shots hit the bottom of the net. Life, love, and hoop forever. Peace.